Hey guys, welcome to What's Going On. As we go through the series of things that they do not teach you in school, today we look at what is success. Well, we're about to find out. What is success? Something we've never been taught at school, unless one A4 sheet, or how to obtain it, um, knowing what it means to you, there's never been a sit down discussion about this whatsoever at all. The school system runs down a path of money, career, ownership. This is wrong and it's damaging to our individual beliefs. It's a narrow construct and let's get into the bones of it. There's people that have money, power and excess wealth, but lack relationships and family as the road through higher education and higher paying jobs is a time hungry thief. Don't get me wrong, if money and career is your ultimate goal for success then follow the path you must take which is well defined by the school system. But remember that happiness and success go hand in hand with sacrifice, hard work and consistency. Don't do what other people do. Thinking your success runs down a predefined ladder of academic goals. Think this though, does a relationship, friends and having kids have a dominant section of your life goals? Don't waste your youth studying for a career that you don't absolutely love. You're going to spend a large portion of your life working so you have to do something that you love. Also be rational on your decisions as we do need money to, to survive and money does give access to certain material happiness as well as being necessary for progressing throughout life. I believe success comes in two forms. The first is the short term, the little goals, the little jobs we set ourselves like lifting that 100 kilo bench press or planting the veggie garden you wanted. These rewards are gratifying once achieved and release dopamine as well as serotonin which gives you that little excitement of completing the job. Then we have the long term. Your dream job, the house you wanted as a kid as you drew on pieces of paper. They take longer but they have a far heavier degree of satisfaction. Sacrifices are made to achieve goals that lead to success. Everyone's road's hard. Every single person has a hard road but you need to know what you want and get it. Success is defined as the accomplishment of an aim or a purpose. I believe that if you know your aim, this will become your purpose. And purpose is undeniably essential for everyone. No doubt, without a doubt, that if you do not have purpose, you cannot direct your life. Success is your idea of happiness at the end of the day. So I think that on your deathbed, with your last breath, you will think one of two things. One would be, I wish I did more. And the second would be, I'm happy with the time I had on this planet. And when you feel that it's too hard and you feel like giving up, think, why did I go down this path in the first place? Go back to your initial reason and from this you will remember why you started this goal in the first place. So we are trained through school and society to believe that success comes from a couple of areas. It's your career, your title and your bank balance. But success is so much more than that. It's your character. It's it's your children, it's your relationship, it's the people which surround you, which give you a greater being. As I stated before, as a CEO may have money, they may have poor health and no meaningful relationships due to work. But in contrast to that, to a fitness freak, which has great health, but no money or career, the, the balance is the key and only you can define what is success. Valuable, not just to you,
but other people around you. Success is being better than the person you were yesterday. That is success. And they should teach that in school. Thank you for watching what's going on. This has been Things I Don't Teach You in School. What is success? If you enjoyed the content, please leave a like. If you want to go further, please subscribe. If you want to leave a comment, do so, my friends. Till next time, be good.